Hey guys, welcome back to Valkyrie Chronicles 2. We're in the uh, second turn, uh, turn of the Barrios Desert map. And right now you can see uh, Marina. I should really send somebody up to save her. But that's not our priority right now. What we're going to do uh, is we should be able to do this My in this turn. turn. Okay. Yes, we're going to take her Enemy sighted. up Enemy and out of And we're just going to run her right around the back. They can do dip all to us. Nothing. Nothing. We're going to switch her to rocket propelled grenades. Remember what I said. Uh, they don't have to kill these guys. All they have to do is get them the hell out of there. Uh, you know what? We're going to wait till our next turn. Alright. Moving out. I don't like shooting at them when I don't have guaranteed Hit. I like it when it's yeah. like that. I don't want to waste it. The bastard lives. I'll just pull it. Ah, uh, he lived. Okay. Okay. So now then, she can make it to here in the next round. Okay. She's gonna take this bastard out. So we're gonna have a little fun because we want maximum points for the amount of work we're doing. So here's a little trick for you guys. These are scouts. Uh, we'll take Freezer. Watch me dance. You're probably pissed about getting shot in the ass. Uh, there's a landmine, so do not walk in front of those. All right. So here's what we're gonna do. Good team, move in. Follow the advance units. Okay, so you've probably been playing this. If you've been playing Activate. along with me, you probably have orders. Well, let's do this. She's gonna stop right here, just on this turn. Okay. Then we're going to do menu. Then we're going to do orders. And then we're going to find damage booze. This is an order. Okay, now watch what I'm going to do. Hurting them means us surviving. Be merciless. I love you, Welkin. Here we go. Here watch we me go. Dance. All right, you see this little blue radiator back here? Bye, Shall friends. That's 250 points right there. And... Next partner. Oh, lo and behold, guys, guess what that means? There's another tank right there. So we're going to walk her around the corner here. Firing capabilities locked. Ah, uh, we'll just stop right here, guys. What do you think, huh? She's still got the status Let's boost. Dance. Time for a quick step. Crap, another tank. That's two tanks gone. Next All right, guys. Partner. We're winning here. We're winning. Okay, here's the tricky part. My turn, okay? This is going to be really quick. Uh, right there. Taking fire. There we go. We got him out. Guess what, guys? This is it. We can win the map right now. Who are these guys? So what I'll do is I'll put her in range. Now, right now, literally, we're done. We can finish the map. I just select her turn, click the button, occupy, we win the map. That's it. Um, I'm going to take a shot at taking out this tank. I think I can do it. Maybe. It's a little bit far out. Yeah, we'll try, though. I mean, we got the demolition order, so... Shall we dance? Yeah, we're too far out. Okay. That's fine. Um, since I almost never do it, I figured I'd run this up and I'll let you guys see the uh, the one squad member you never hear from, our medic. Okay, I got it. So if you ever have a character that does die in battle or falls in battle, you can just do this. Don't go out alone. Back each other up. Run up to him and medic. There you go. I don't remember, but I don't think the poor girl don't has a worry. name. I'll take care of it. You can't die! Uh, so the only thing you gotta remember with this, guys, is if you, oh, would you stop shooting at me? Uh, you're not worth any points, but... Um... Uh, I mean, they're really not. It's not worth shooting at. Just go right here. Alright, just crouch right there. Okay, they're not, um, the regular guys in white. This guy, this guy, this guy, this guy. 
they're not worth anything. Uh, the one guy that was here is worth some. The one guy that was right here is worth some. All three tanks are worth something. Uh, I don't. I can't get her close enough to shoot that tank. If I could, I would. I take it out. We take the money and run. You know. Uh, <laughs> So basically, this map is done, okay? Um, I have two turns to play with. I'm so on it. Sorry, I just want to get revenge yeah, I'll shoot, one thing. And I'm a whatever. Uh, woman after my own heart. Okay, go up here. Okay, so another thing that I get used to is if they are ducking, I'll show you what I mean. I know it takes forever to turn. No headshots. It's a behind sandbag, so that's kind of why that guy right there is an absolute... These guys are dicks. They'll pop the sandbag back and forth, back and forth, back and forth, until you can't win. Alright. So we got one turn left, uh, and that'll be it. You want to send My turn, okay. Alicia? There you go. So that's in two turns, guys. That, uh, this should be an A rank. Um, you get this access to this map after you do the hellaciously fun. Look at that, 27,390. And, and if you uh, stretch it out a little bit, I guarantee you, a little work, you can get that third light tank. They're 300 apiece for the tanks. Uh, each enemy leader is 250. Um, you pull 43,000 money on that 27,390 experience, which is a level for any character class at this level. Um, so let's go ahead and go we'll back out. Go right here. No, we don't want to do that. We want to go to headquarters. I'm going to listen to old Billy Joe Jim Bob there yell at us. So I'm going to take you through a couple of these Welcome menus. You. Trade up. Uh, we're going to take you through a couple of menus after I finish this up. So, all right. Alright, so there you go. There's my engineers getting their 13th level. Now, you see what I mean? At level 13, it's only 20,398 to level them up. Uh, it's 32,000 for my troopers. These guys are way higher. Uh, I'm over leveled. Um, let's take the snipers up. Fight! That, was that not enough? Ooh, denied by 30. That's just wrong. Okay, so let me, uh, since I got a few minutes in the rest of this video, let me take you through uh, a couple of things. So you got the command room. Uh, you've seen me use Melville. You've seen me use um, a couple other guys. Look at all these other guys I can put in. Uh, one thing, guys, you want to remember, uh, um, you, you can see right here, there's uh, the personal skills, neat freak, chat, uh, chameleon, chatty Cathy. Uh, chatty Cathy only means she'll do that more often if she's near Cherry, Edie, or Audrey. If any of those three, if you put those idiots together, you get that. Susie, that fourth one, humanitarian, worst thing in the game. She's one of the best scouts too, but once she gets that, she's useless. Uh, she won't take the kill shot. So, and your scouts are near monsters. Um, you know, I have all these guys, and uh, the way you get there, I don't think I have anybody new. Oh, yeah. So, you see how there's a, a P with a dash through it? That means if I take these guys out, uh, which I should do, let me just swap out. Homer doesn't have his yet. So, I have to bring him into fights, deploy him. Uh, just getting deployed is like a single point. Uh, if I use him to take over a base, you get like five points, two points for killing somebody, whatever. Um, so I do need to switch out. Emil's supposed to be here. She needs to go away. And then we'll switch in. Herbert. Lord knows I'll never use two engineers. You only need one. I'm actually waiting. Uh, she's the best engineer normally. She hates men, so she doesn't like welcome. But she loves Alicia, and you always have Alicia next to the friggin' tank because she was in love with Wilkin, so, you know, you get the most things going off at once. Um, Ramsey's pretty good, too. Occasionally, the Fatalist stuff is stupid, but she's always behind the tank, so it doesn't come into the picture. 
Uh, maintenance lazy isn't as bad as it sounds. It doesn't proc all that often. But Metalhead does proc often. Um, there's a ton of different ones. And I actually don't have them all yet. There's... Uh, let me see... There's a couple of characters. I think they might be in with me. Um, there's a couple of characters you can get. Uh, I recommend going to like Game Facts because I, I don't remember the exact ones. There's one you get from having a, a like a million money. Uh, DCT, Come I forget what it's called. Uh, on that 674,000. If you do those skirmishes, you get them pretty quick. Uh, trading field, we've been through that R&D facility. This opens up as you progress through well the stories. Uh, you have developed weapons, rifles, uh, and you can... Now, you, once you get here, you can select. Normally, I, I, I don't mess with the stuff that do the status effect. It's better to have... If you kill them quick, you ain't got to worry about it. Uh, same for machine guns. Flamethrowers, right? You also got the tank. Uh, you got your regular level ups. And the question marks unlock with story. And then you got... These items right here, they level up. But you can see, sorry, you can see where it says, um, see that's uh, four by one block size. What that's referring to is right here. And let's say I want to change parts and I want to put this in. See, I got to make it fit in this little tiny box right here. So if I want that extra magazine, I need, and I can't adjust whether it's turned to the left, turned to the right doesn't matter so uh, if I wanted to do that I have to give up you know this or these or you know one of these something has to be given up so you're constantly looking around to see what the best is come back again if you keep your money up and you keep up with it you never have a problem uh, and honestly keep an engineer behind your tank in the battles that you needed you never have to worry about it Anyways, guys, I'm about at the limit for this episode. So thank you guys so much for watching my videos. This is Valkyria Chronicles. I'm JD Sensei. I thank you so much. Please like, share, and subscribe. And I will see you all in the next video. Bye, guys.